children's devotional. We are happy that you can join us today. Today we are going to look at how God can use us to make a difference in other people's life. As we look at 2 Kings chapter 5, we see this, the story of a man called Naaman. Now Naaman, he was a great warrior for his king, Aaron, and he it was able to win battles. But he was also a leper. And he did not know how to get cured of his leprosy. But while they were raiding Israel, they were able to pick find a little girl who came from Israel and she started to serve Naaman's wife. And while she was serving Naaman's wife, she asked, why don't uh, Naaman go to the Israel Samaria and be healed from the prophet that is there? Naaman went to his king and told his king that there was somebody in Israel who could heal him. The king wrote a letter to the king of Israel so that Naaman could get to go to Israel. And when Naaman went to Israel and he went to the king of Israel, the king of Israel says, why did your king send a letter to me to ask that I will get you to heal? I'm not gone, but there was someone who says, I know of a man called Elisha. Let him go to Elisha. And he went to Elisha and Elijah said, I won't be able to help you, but God can help you go and dip in the river Jordan seven times. Nehemiah was angry. The river Jordan, that river is dirty. He don't know who I am. He don't even want to come and talk to me properly. But I must go and dip in the river seven times. And his servant said, come, we want to get healed, let's try it. And his servants encouraged him to go and dip in the river Jordan. And he dipped. And he came up, nothing happened. And he dipped again. And he came up, nothing happened. And he dipped, and he dipped, and he dipped seven times. When he came up the seventh time, his skin was nice and clean and he started rejoicing because he was cured of leprosy and he went back to the prophet that he that went told him to go in the river and the prophet said i don't want anything from you just go back home and he says okay give me some dirt and when i go back home and when i'm worshiping i will stand on the dirt but I will not worship the gods of my nation. I will worship the Lord God Almighty. And he went back home. Boys and girls, that little girl, she was little, but she knew who she name can turn to for help. And because she opened her mouth and gave God praise, and guide him towards somebody who can help him. He was able to be healed. First today is not by might nor by power, but by my spirit, said the Lord. Zechariah 4, 6 Not by might, nor by power, but by my spirit, said the Lord. Dear Father, I just want to thank you that even as you showed Naaman of God that it's 
by your spirit God that he was healed and not because of anything any man has done God you can show us oh God in our life oh God that is by your spirit oh God things are done Father Lord I thank you right now oh God for working in our life for your good for showing us your love and your guidance God Minister unto all these boys and girls, O oh God. Let them know that you love them and you care for them. You care for them so much that you sent Jesus to die for our sins, God. And Father, I thank you for your healing and your strength in our life. Help us to know that we can come to you, God, because it's by your Spirit, O oh God, that we will be healed and we'll be set free, O oh God. I thank you for your deliverance in our life, God. In Jesus' name. Amen. Boys and girls, I thank you for joining us this day. See you next time.